Grace Kitchens is pleased to present Creative Cooking. Tasty, nutritious meal ideas for homemakers and their families. And now, here is today's host. Today I have a very special guest in the kitchen with me. He is Mr. George Phillips, better known to his friends as King Eitel, the owner of King Eitel Restaurant in Crossroads, Kingston. I make sure to say Crossroads Kingston because there are several crossroads all over Jamaica. Mr. Phillips, welcome to our program. It is our Thank pleasure you to have, have you. Here. Tell us about some of the meal ideas, especially lunch ideas or dinner ideas that you serve at your place. Well, we have the tofu ball. Tofu ball. That's one of, and we have veggie chunks in different variety. Mm -hmm. uh, curry, brown stew in all different styles. Yes. Uh, chunks and bean. Mm -hmm. and we have veggie mince mm -hmm. and veggie ball, vegetable with ackee and Vegetable rundown, that kind of vegetable mix. chop soy. Now what are you cooking for us today? Well, today I'm preparing some vegetable, tofu balls. Some tofu balls? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, what, what sort of tofu are you using? Uh, just regular tofu. Mm -hmm. yeah. okay. This is about a pound of tofu. About, okay, fine. Yeah. Let's show you the recipe for tofu balls. And then I'm going to get out of the kitchen. You see, I'm leaving this space all up to Mr. Phillips, who's going to prepare this meal for all of us. Hello Jamaica, I'm preparing for you today a uh, tofu ball. This is the tofu, for prepare it to crush the tofu. Yeah. When it's crushed then you add your seasoning that you're going to season up the ball with. A little touch of garlic, scallion, thyme, our local product. Mm, scotch one and pepper, onion, sweet pepper, then add your breadcrumbs. Now the breadcrumbs is for wall it together. Mm. Uh, like a wall with flour. You know, most of you use the flour if you don't like flour. You can just breadcrumbs alone can do it. And you mix all of this together. Then now you're going to make your ball. You save a little of the flour. The flour, the reason why you save the flour, it save it from the oil. Don't penetrate into the ball that it's not that oily. The flour, keep it out. So don't cover the pores and things like that. Okay, meanwhile the ball is frying now, we're going to prepare the sauce now for the ball. First you add your coconut milk. Then this is pumpkin. And the season, you already have a season remain, like sweet pepper, add to your sauce, scotch on it. Make a thyme. Onion, scallion, and your garlic, and a little primitive seed. The primitive seed is all purpose, using everything. It should take about 10 to 15 minutes to complete. And you can just turn your ball. If you like coloring in your sauce, you can add a little sauce to it, if you like the colouring. And don't forget your ketchup. Okay, you just add in the finished ball. And you can just let them stay for the next, for about five minutes. You don't need more than five minutes for them to soak and get back the body after the sauce. And then over here now, we already have some Brown rice and boiled banana trimmings. Hello, Mr. Phillips. Hello, hello, Mr. Phillips. <laughs> I've enjoyed tofu in a number of ways, but I've never had it like this. And I want to thank you for sharing this idea with us. It's an interesting way to use a pumpkin. Yeah? Very. And nice. you know that 
imagine pumpkin, the orange or yellow of pumpkin combined with a little bit of ketchup and a soy sauce. Does offer a lovely flavor, yeah? It does. So when I come to your place for lunch, I've had breakfast there, but when I come for lunch, I can expect the seeds on the menu, right? Yes, okay. Ah, okay. Thanks again. It was okay. indeed a pleasure working with you. Okay. Right, right. Tofu is a frequently used food in vegetarian diets. When we come back, we'll tell you more about tofu and its many uses. <laughs> Welcome back. With me to tell us about tofu is Mrs. Paulette Roden, a director at Crimson Dawn Limited. And Mrs. Roden is also a professional chef. Mrs. Roden, welcome to Creative Cooking again. It's <laughs> nice to be here with you, Ma uh, Maisie. Tell us about the types of tofu that, that there are. Uh, tofu is made from soya beans. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, we have two types of tofu. Two types. You have the soft tofu mm. or silkien, mm. and you have the firm tofu that is used more or less in the general kitchen. Okay. The silkien or soft tofu is used a lot in desserts, pastry, and any type of salads or whatever it is. Okay, I okay. buy this now, put it in the fridge, in the package, this is a Tetra pack, yes. and it will stay six weeks in there without a problem. Once you open the package, if you Once you open the package, it. you place it in, you wash it off, yeah. and you place it in a container, preferably a glass container. You're able to see through it. That you can see through, and you cover it with water. Okay. This water must be changed every two days. Yes. We use it in the Chinese kitchen a lot. Yes. And here we're doing a lovely dish of broccoli, shrimp, and tofu with carrots, yes. and onions, and mm -hmm. tomatoes. And this is just stir fried. I know a lot of the people, like our Rastafarians, yes. they like the stews stew. and yes. so. Right. And this is a stew I did with um, red, kidney red, red kidney beans, yes. a little bit of um, veggie chunks, and it has dumplings and tofu. Mm -hmm. This one now is interesting because once you do, you, you season your tofu and you let it soak for a little bit season. I'm going to come back to the season. You can then, what we call, pan fry them or shallow fry them yes. in a little, using a little bit of uh, flour. Yes. I also find it very interesting to use a little cornmeal and that adds even yeah. more nutrient Definitely. to the product. And a lovely sort of crust. Crust, yeah. yes. Mm -hmm. This I did is a dish of um, ackee with tofu. This would make a lovely appetizer if you're having a vegetarian person for dinner. You can make ice cream, pies, cheesecake, puddings, cakes. The list is uh, endless. endless. Mrs. And it's Roden, interesting. thank you so much. Maisie, it was thank my you. pleasure to be pleasure here. And I do you. hope that your viewers will try to use the tofu more often and then it will help them health-wise. We look forward to hearing from you at Grace Kitchens. We invite you to call, write, fax or email us. We are waiting on your call. Till next time, we thank you so much for watching. Creative Cooking, broadcast on CVM TV every Tuesday and Friday at 7.50 p.m. Join us next time for Creative Cooking, brought to you by Grace Kitchens, helping Jamaican homemakers prepare tastier meals for themselves and their families.